Hi, this is a demonstration of how to use our application on drugs in pregnancy, an application we developed. We are clinical pharmacists and physicians uh, all working in a university hospital in Paris, France, as you may hear from my accent. Um, well, when you launch the application, you have here the home screen. Uh, as you can see, you can share this on Facebook with your contacts. And you have in the middle that big uh, gray button, which is actually the most important one because when you press it you uh, access the list uh, of the drugs the medications that are uh, in the app uh, to date to date we have a little bit more than 4000 references in this list so you may scroll the list but it could be easier to here search for the medication you are looking for advice for instance we will be looking for uh, advices on Advil um, and you tap here sorry ADV and Advil is here and you access the the advice page for Advil as you can see here you have the mentions T1 T2 and T3 which is uh, which are the the trimesters of your pregnancy T1 is the first trimester of your pregnancy where you've been pregnant from uh, 0 to 3 months the first 3 months then the second trimester and the last trimester the last here uh, section is lactation. When you're breastfeeding your baby, there are some drugs that you should not take while you breastfeed. And uh, below uh, are the advices. Uh, OK means that you may take the drug without any risk for you or for your baby. And of course, no, as you can see here for the third trimester of pregnancy here, when you have that no mentioned, this means that you should not take the drug because it can be toxic either for you or for your baby. Here you can uh, see a little bit more in depth uh, what are uh, the abbreviations used and some definitions of the classes of medicines according to the FDA, the American Food and Drug Administration. And that gray button uh, gives, uh, uh, draws you back to the list of the drugs. In that list, we search here for Advil, but we could uh, uh, use the we could have used the scientific name also, which is ibuprofen. And when you type here IBU, you have ibuprofen, and you are reaching the same advice page uh, as for Advil, of course.